Try this, sir. Please. This is a privileged motion. No. Please. Don't not try this, sir. You are an agent. You are an agent of Ambani. Please. 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 Sir, he was a dream of all the middle class people. So why? He said, I'll bring the prices of airline ticket to the railways. And he did it. With Deccan Airways, that too from your state, sir. He brought it, he made a revolution in air travel. We all thought the government, that to the new government, or the past 10 years, whichever government was, will reduce the air, uh, air fare rate. Sir, today, yes, the air fare is equal to train, sir, train charges. One day Bharat. Because one day our train charges have increased so much that now it's a, sir, I'm requesting the things that, sir, today, you are just copying what is instructed by you by FAA. You are copying, amending that because European airport authorities want you to follow. Ranji spoke about the sale of Air India for 18,000 crores. However, the value realization for this deal he is not talking about. Through this deal, 15,300 crore of Air India's debts will be paid for by the acquiring company and won't be a, burden, a further burden on the taxpayers. The winning bid is also significantly higher than the 12,906 crore, which is the reserve price set by the government for the sale of the company. I also want to highlight that Dayanadi Maranji and his elder brother had sold Spice Jet for just rupees 2 in 2015. According to the share price at that time of the SPA, the stake worth was worth 765 crore which was sold for rupees 2 and at least he should then realize what is it when we sold Air India on enterprise value that he should know and he should in fact appreciate the point having himself at a personal level been involved with sale of a particular airlines and at that rate and therefore sir at the time SpiceJet reportedly had debt and liabilities outstanding of rupees 3,500 crores with immediate payables of rupees 2,200 crore and the book value of the company was minus 24 per share. So, the situation of an airline company and in that a company which doesn't make profit and then trying to sell it and selling it at a value of rupees 2 per share, I am sure member, honorable member Dayanadi Maran will appreciate and know how companies are being sold because he himself sold his company at 2 rupees and when it was in minus 24 per share. வாலுவேசும்